This is still the most stable custom room even at the end of 2023. In this year, we tried a lot of custom rooms and in the end, this is the only one which I definitely can say that the stable one right now. Even I am using a Pixel device, but I am still using Lineage OS and this is what we are talking about. And this is also updated to the latest Android version, sorry, the latest security patch, which is December 2023. While making this video, it's not updated to Android 14 yet. And as I always say, this is the most stable custom room right now, which means if you will get Android 14, you will get the most stable version of Android 14. Right now, while making this video, I tried a lot of Android 14 based custom rooms. Quite good custom rooms are available, which are quite stable, but not every custom room is stable right now. There are some minor issues, at least here and there, but Lineage will give you Android 14 when the things will be quite solid, the things will be quite stable. But right now, I tried this custom room and it's still good enough to use on a device as your daily driver. This custom room is only one of the few custom rooms which brings you same camera in almost every device, whichever device you use. For example, this is the Aperture camera which is available here and you will get Aperture camera in every device whichever you use. For example, I am using Pixel device right now. Even if I use my Poco device, if I use my other devices, I will definitely get this Aperture camera. If I am using a Pixel device and I want to switch to Google camera, I can install from Google Play Store and that is working fine by the way. I tried using this custom room. One little bit of disadvantage, not could be a big one, but is this could be advantage. This could be a disadvantage actually. What this is, as uh, if you want to root, if you want to pass safety net status or integrity fix, etc., you have to root your device. By default, like other custom rooms, you will not get the safety net passed and things are okay. You have to root your device. You have to use a safety net fix to pass safety net, but that's quite optional. I mean, if you want to do this thing or not, it's totally up to you. But this is the thing which you have to keep in mind while using Lineages on a device. And as I just mentioned once again, this is still the great custom rooms right now. One of those great custom rooms or stable custom rooms even in the last of 2023, end of 2023. As after using a lot of custom rooms, this could be the thing. This is not a customization focused custom room, by the way. So if you move on to the settings, you will find the st stock UI, same kind of UI here as it is kind of okay. It's not having the pixel features by default available. You have to compromise with a few of the pixel specific features. It also brings you the OTA updates feature. So yes, if you want to update your device through OTA, you can do that. This custom room is one of those custom room which brings you OTA updates, especially if you use Lineage OS recovery then this could be a great process, easy process for you. And yes, you can update your device almost every week. For my device, I get update almost every week. So that's also quite amazing. Like other custom room, this actually does not bring you face unlock. And I never saw face unlock in Lineage OS any version so far. Um, there might be a major reason, solid reason behind that. But you have the fingerprint unlock, which is actually a very secure thing as compared to face unlock. So this could be the reason. But we have face unlock, we have the fingerprint unlock, sorry for that, we don't have that face unlock available. In more security settings, you have kind of same options available here and there. Some things could be device specific, but most of the things are same here. One of the great features of Lineage OS is this trust application, where you will find this restrict USB option. This is quite underrated, but quite useful option available here. You can simply restrict the USB connections and it's totally optional. I mean, if you want to use this thing or not, or if you don't want to, you can simply skip this thing. This is not giving you any kind of same UI like other Android 13 based custom rooms. Like if, if in case if you ever use Android 13 based custom rooms, you know that they already were bringing you some Android 14 features inbuilt like the new new back gesture and the enhanced pin privacy option. Those features are not available in Lineage OS. They will not give you those features. You have to update to Android 14. And as I just mentioned, the starting of the video is not updated to Android 14 yet while making this video. Lineage OS 21 with Android 14 is coming soon and I will definitely make sure we'll give you the review about that one. The first look changes everything. So make sure to subscribe the channel for that and also hit the notification bell icon so that you will be notified after for these those things. We also have some charging control options available. This is one of the most useful features out there. I'm not exactly sure how many of you will use this thing, but it is available. I just wanted to let you know. These are some noticeable changes which are available here. Last but not the least, we also have some audio things. I mean, audio mode by default available. The name is AudioFX, quite popular, quite underrated. 
it's already available in the many devices by default in lineage os so these were things i just wanted to let you know hope you like this thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one make sure to drop a like to this video